Robert Gray has lived through history, 103 years of history. Robert Gray was born in 1889. He never thought he would live this long. No, uh, anybody would ask me I'd live this long. 40 years ago, I'd have said you didn't have no sense, man. <laughs> you like to drive? Yeah. <laughs> Robert still drives, but only on sunny days. His eyesight is too poor to drive when it's cloudy. Yeah, about six months ago, holy followed me about two miles. <laughs> to avoid traffic, Robert takes the back roads, and he always drives to the same place. A few years ago, this nursing home became home to his best friend. Robert visits every sunny day. Don't they feed you good, yeah? Sometimes it's good, and sometimes <laughs> it ain't. <laughs> Bertha Gray is 100 years old. She's also Robert's wife. They've been married 82 years. That's longer than any other couple in the United States. Don't you wish you'd have said no? No. You don't? No. To watch them is like watching a couple of teenagers on their first date. They're in love, have been since 1909. Hey, you ain't satisfied of me, are you? Yeah. <laughs> I've been <laughs> I don't know how long we'll be here, but we're still here. <laughs> the hardest time for the Grays is the time they spend apart. Robert lives alone and constantly thinks about Bertha. Man, I never did have a fuss. We never had a quarrel. But on sunny days, they're together, each one holding on to the moment, hoping it will last forever. Kiss me, I'm leaving. You're leaving. I'll be back when the sun shines. Well, come back. I'll yeah. meet you at the station when the train pulls in. Scott Rensberger, Channel 2 News at 6.